Okay, there is one setting that affects um, regeneration in the car, and it's in the EV menu. It, you can get at that in various ways by a setup if you're on that particular screen, or press the car, get rid of the split screen, and I think if you go into energy information, no wrong, and again. EV settings and the smart recuperation which is the same as regen. If you set it to strong deceleration then when you have auto regen on or you're regening you'll find the car um, decelerates a lot quicker. Uh, some people may find this very jerky and uh, some people might get motion sick so they set it as medium um, by default. I've had it on strong and I just find it's a bit jerky and even I was getting, it was trying to dip it up, uphill, so I wasn't completely happy with that. So I, I think the middle one is probably the best, and you can set it to soft deceleration as well. From the EV menu, the electric, electric vehicle menu, you you can go into the energy information screen and look at consumption, and that gives you a live uh, picture of what's being consumed. Um, when you're actually doing regen, it shows you what's being pumped back into the battery so you get a negative figure on, on usage in driving and, and you can see there's quite a lot going back in when you do regen. To change the uh, regen and auto regen settings um, you have to be moving and driving the car so you can't do them whilst you're sitting in it and it's not moving so um, I'll show you how to do that. To control regen you've got the left and right paddles um, The left one puts regen on and eventually if you keep on pulling it you'll go into eye pedal mode and I think the right hand one reduces uh, regen and I think if you press and hold it you can get auto regen to come on but I'll demonstrate that. Right, so if, if I pull on the right hand one, you'll see the regen is reduced down to level one or to none. That's free flowing now and the car just goes without any kind of braking action on it at all. Um, I pulled it back up and that set it to auto, but the auto also has multiple levels as well. And again, you can just those with the plus and minus regen paddle. So I've just my seat belt just button. <laughs> if you pull up on the uh, plus one, you'll see I'm increasing the regen level for auto, and it's going the way up. Also notice if I uh, lay off. Um, you'll see I'm, I'm generating energy by just letting it roll downhill. It's, it's turning the motor around and turning it into a dynamo in effect. So I'm just generating 30 kilowatts just by rolling. But that, that's what it would be in an hour, not just in a few seconds. So I, I can reduce, I can, if I pull up on the right hand paddle, it'll turn auto off. See that's gone back to manual. Um, what the auto mode does, it looks for traffic ahead. And if you're coming up to the back of a car, it'll um, increase regen on its own. So I can put that back on and it's gone back on. Um, I really need some traffic to show you it working though. Um,
we go. Let's look up behind this one. The green, the green auto means it's spotted the car and traffic in front. I don't know if, uh, if you can also see that on the vehicle display like that. Yeah, maybe you can. Yeah. You just press the menu button until that comes around. It's gone too far off now in front. need to get behind something to show you how it works. <laughs> I'm hoping that lorry's going the right way. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, some traffic, that's what I needed. Okay, uh, when, I, when I get up close, you'll see that um, it's spotted the traffic, but that's not showing on the display, so it doesn't mean it's showing anything really, does it? But you can see it's turned green, the auto's turned green, which means it's seeing the traffic. So, so if I pull up close and let my foot off, you, you'll, you'll just get tons of regen, like that. Right, that's basically how it works. Um, the higher the regen level, the more regen you're going to get, but I mean, the car will slow down quicker. Um, then you've got the eye pedal. Um, again, you can only put that on whilst you're moving. Now, you pull on the left paddle, hold it. Or maybe I turn off auto and then I pull it. Yeah, yeah. Auto's got to be off. Then pull the left regen paddle to get eye pedal on. Eye pedal is one pedal driving, so you're just using the accelerator, and then it'll regen on its own. You, you don't have to brake; it'll brake for you using the radar and detectable cars in front. Um, so it has to have a car in front, obviously, otherwise it's not going to stop. you find it slows down quicker in eye pedal mode. And that's all there is to it really. Uh, not, not a lot else to show. left hand paddle, pull that up, that's one level, added a regen. If you go above three and you're not in auto mode, you'll go into eye pedal. Right hand paddle reduces regen. Um, if you're in auto mode, you press and hold, it turns auto mode off. If auto mode's not on, press and hold, it turns it on. 